Well, a new report came out, guys, that Pink, okay, the pop rocker, the psychopath, path dirt bag, just whatever, just disgusting human being that she is, is reportedly raising her kids to be gender neutral. That's right. Pink is a huge advocate for gender neutrality, and she, apparently she's be raising her kids uh, to be the same way. Uh, it's it's truly uh, sad because she believes this is what she believes in her household that they live in a labor in a labelless household. That is according to Pink, the singer who is now 38 years old and married to motorcycle racer Carrie Hart. Uh, who has told the UK's the people that she does not want her children defined by their gender. Not at all. Pink said that she is delighted that her six-year-old daughter, Willow, told her that she wants to marry an African woman when she grows up. Well, isn't that nice, an African woman? We are a very labelless household, Pink said. <laughs> it's just insane. I still can't get over this. Well, last week, she says, last week, Willow told me that she is going to marry an African woman. I was like, great. Can you teach me how to make African food then? And she's like, sure, mama. And we are going to live with you while our house is getting ready. Pink continues saying, I was like, what the bleep? Who are you? Who is paying for this? Who is paying for all this, by the way, she said. Well, the performer went on to say here and say that she has been a champion. That's right. She is a champion, guys, of the gender neutrality, okay? Uh, and, and being the fact that she does not even acknowledge, get this, she does not acknowledge the science of two biological sexes, that being male and female. In other words, normal, being normal. She does not, she, she does not agree with that. She does not identify with that or even recognize it whatsoever. She said this, quote, I was in school and the bathroom outside the kindergarten said gender neutral anybody. And it was drawing of and it was a drawing of many different shapes. She said, I took a picture of it and I wrote progress. I thought it was awesome. I love that kids are having this conversation. Well, Kim <laughs> Pink continues on here, guys, talking about gender neutrality. Uh, I mean, it's just. You know, it's one thing for these stars to live the life that they do. Um, and the fact that they advocate and they, they champion for the sin. They champion for immorality. Okay. And look, they're going to have to answer to God for that one day. But who I really feel bad about bad for are these kids. All right. The kids of these celebrities, these, these liberal leftist, you know, globalist, you know, glorifying immorality and sin celebrities. I feel horrible for these kids is their parents are brainwashing them. You know, it's bad enough that the schools are already brainwashing the kids, but when the parents start doing the same thing, you know, it's like, who do these kids have to turn to? You, just, you have to keep them in prayer. Uh, you, you have to pray that, you know, somebody will share the, the love of Jesus Christ with them, uh, that they will not, because if they continue to be raised this way and develop this way, they're going to adopt the same mindset uh, of their parents and all these elitists, and, and it's truly crazy. It's so important we pray for kids. Guys, uh, we are living in the last days. There's no question about it. Jesus Christ is coming back soon. If you don't know him as your Lord and Savior today, if you would like to, please let me know. Leave me a comment below. Let me know you would like to receive Christ as your Lord and Savior today. You can be born again, forgiven of all of your sins. Come into the kingdom of God today, where you will have everlasting life and a home in heaven for all of eternity. There's no greater decision that you're ever going to make than to give your life to Christ. I pray you guys make that decision today. You can also email me directly at cardsfan480 at gmail.com. I'll put my email right below in the description. You guys can access it from there. Please also send any prayer requests you guys may have. I would love to pray for you, whatever your need might be today. Go ahead and send those down. I would love to do that for you. In the meantime, I'll continue to keep you up to speed here on all the latest breaking news, prophecy headlines, and current world events. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please. Be safe out there. Don't forget to share these videos with your friends and family. God bless each and every single one of you. And I'll talk with you soon.